Hello everyone, this video I will show you our new product. Uh, this is existing external relay module that is V2 version. And you can see this is E16, that is V1, and this is V2. We have redesigned the hardware of the PCB, and we have replaced the button with a metal button. And this is the output. Every relay will have calm and normal open and normal close, so that uh, you can use for some different application and some solutions. Okay, let's look at some hardware details. Okay, let's look at this E16 V2 version of the PCB board. And this is Omro Relay Extend module. You can see this is in front of this board. And here is the back. And this time you can also use this uh, thing install the thing rail. That will be easy to install in your power distribution box. And uh, let's look at uh, this uh, size. You can see here, this is the lens of this E16 part. And here you can see, uh, this is the white of the part. And we have updated this part instead of this E16 V1. You can see this V1 only come and the normal open. You can see here, come and normal open. But this time, you can see every channel of relay that will have come, normal open and normal close. This is normal open. And this terminal is normal close. So every channel will have this four screw. This is channel one, four screw, and this channel two, four, four screw. So you can connect with this common, common and normal close, or this common and normal close, normal open. So that will be flexible for connect with your one. And we can put this two board. You can see uh, this just uh, a little long than this board. And the ones you can see here, that is a little long than this old version. And another improvement you can see here, this is the button is plastic. And this time, the V2 version, we have used the metal. The metal switch, that will be have bad experience. So you can see here, if I can manually control turn on and turn off, so that will be easy to know. Uh, this is off and uh, this is on, because the button have different position. And this part, just uh, up and down, up and down. So that's for on off. And this relay also is removable, so you can replace this relay very easily. If the broke, the relay is bad or is broken. Okay, let's uh, connect with the power line. We can test it. Uh, we can use this. I have used the DC 12 watt. If you want to use the 24 volt of the relay, just replace this relay with the 24 volt, and you can connect with with the 24 volt. Now I'm testing just to use the 12 volt. So you can see this, that is the terminal, and the orange is power, and the black is ground. And here you can see the 16 channel input. When the input connect with the power, that relay will be on. So that the input disconnect with this power, that relay will be off. Okay, we connect with this one. Give it DC 12 power volts. And also, I use this cable, uh, this, this cable, because I want to uh, triangle the input with this DC 12 volts. Okay, you can see this power supply, and here I can connect with this, and you can see now already is on because the manual control button. You can see that can be turn on and turn off. That will be very good experience. And also you can use this, uh, use this input. I can shut for this channel two, that for on. And shut for on, shut for on, and remove for off. So every channel input, you just shut and not shut with the control this relay for on and off. And also you can use this one. 
So that can connect with a smart loop controller and install to your power distribution box. And the menu country button and the remove relay and the output for COM, NO, and NC. Okay, thanks for watching.